the higher self itself is already fulfilled. There is nobody else to fulfill furthermore. It's already the case. That's the beauty of the higher self. That's why everyone is longing for that. Everyone is longing to travel from the ego self to the higher self because it's already fulfilled. How can I connect to it? It's only a connectivity, not improvisation. There is no way to improvise on the higher self. <laughs> it's already full of improvement. So even the fulfillment is connected to the ego, <laughs> not connected with the higher self. So the question has to be reshuffled, <laughs> reshuffling. Fulfillment of the ego. I'm just changing the alignment of the question. <laughs> it has to be like this. Fulfillment of the ego, celebration of the self. <laughs> that should be the right alignment. Because you don't have anything to do with the higher self, you can only celebrate nothing else. That's why often I used to say meditation is a, a lazy man's longing. <laughs> Once you achieve meditation, you don't have to do many things. Everything you can enjoy. Celebration happens. For me, meditation means connecting with the higher self. Connected to the higher self. Relating with the higher self, which is deep inside us, beyond the mind, beyond the emotions, beyond all. Center of attraction. So fulfillment is normally fitting with the ego, fulfilling the ego. The more you fulfill it, asking more, <laughs> asking for more, so greedy. <laughs> So this much difference, it makes you tired and you start fulfilling the ego is a never ending story. You become tired. I have seen many people, they started seeking and they started traveling in spirituality because at one point of time, they become tired of the ego. <laughs> Asking more and more. Sucking the energy, become exhausted. They tried all the ways, finally they found out, okay, spirituality is the way. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make a full stop to, to this tiresome game. Mm -hmm.